Hello folks, welcome to B-A-B-G. That's an acronym for our show, Beer and Board Games. And since this is a comedy show, you might even call it a laugh Ha-ha! Hee <laughs> Ho-ho! Really? Again? Again what? Th what you got on your skin. Oh, this? Yeah. I, I don't pay attention to what I wear. I just wear any old thing. You just threw, threw it on. Yeah, wasn't even paying attention. But you know what? For the next show, I will change out of this shirt into a different shirt that is completely not weird at all. And at that point, I will say, I got 99 problems, but a shirt ain't one. And I've got 99 problems, and not having beer is one. So, Brennan, if you please. We gotta come up with a name for Brennan. Doesn't feel right calling him Fuhorbe. Beer buddy? <laughs> tall boy? <laughs> I like it. Because he's, he's tall, oh, and that's a beer tall. thing. Tall boy. Hey, what are we? Tonight, we're opening Two Gun Brown from the Blue Blood Brewing Company. I pour beer like a shithead. That's an intense brown. So much brown. If Greg Benson showed you this brown, you'd pass the fuck out. Yeah. I've said it before and I'll say it again, brown beer is my favorite type of beer and this does not disappoint. All right, well let's get started on playing Lafgrenims. Let's get started. We're gonna draw from this deck of cards and we're going to get acronyms that already exist, but we're gonna make new ones and they're gonna be funny, and then we're going to draw what those acronyms are. There's always gonna be one person who uh, runs each round, so in order to determine who's gonna do that first, we are gonna play a mini round of Lafcronyms using our own initials. Just as quickly say what our initials are, I am MPS. AJM. BJJ. AMY, a girl's name. He's got a fellatio name. That's worse. You probably got fucked up in high school because of that, right? Yeah and teaching middle school. I'm done, and I'm gonna win. Average masculine yo! And the drawing is very masculine, as you can see. <laughs> Mega penis superstore! I feel well, like I've already schools. gone wrong because I didn't include penises in mine. I did angry jelly making. I think your drawing might be too good. It might become a detriment to you in this game. <laughs> For mine, the comments are disabled. Bringing jealous Jews. Oh. Yeah. That's not cool. Why are they baby It's not. I don't know. <laughs> why are you, I ran why out of are time. you bringing them? I don't, I don't understand that. This is pretty sad. You are going to circle one, two, three, or four, which person you find is the funniest. No, you cannot vote for your own. It's a fucking tie between Matt and Aaron. Well, this dicks divide. <laughs> <laughs> you can go first. Military Minds Memorized, D-O-D, stands for Department of Defense. Go on the offensive and say it also means... There's points at the bottom of the card, so this one is worth three points. The winner is whoever gets to 21 points first. I have to say I like this already because they've structured the game in a way where the person who's the judge also gets to play. Yeah, that's nice. Number one, dumb old dog. It's a <laughs> dumb dog. It's saying buh. <laughs> buh. And he's got a little hat with a flower on it. <laughs> <laughs> like dumb people wear. <laughs> Dumb old dog. Demonized oral destruction. Holy shit, is he breathing fire on his dick? <laughs> Dicks over Denver. Dwarf on dick sucking. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Give me that D. Woo! Ooh. Make your vote. Made a vote. I have cast my vote. The votes are three, Two, four. Three. Three is the winner. Three is the winner. Dicks over Denver. Nice. Congratulations. No one voted for dumb old dog. Come on, this game is fun. Let's keep going, let's keep it rolling. This is a five-pointer. Whoa. Early programmers perceived BASIC to stand for Beginner's All-Purpose Symbolic Instruction Code. Syntax error, because it actually means, and then fill it in, B-A-S-I-C. <laughs> you guys, oh, this is so much fun. <laughs> Brandon, it's time. You gotta, oh, no. you gotta finish up, buddy. Time is way up. Oh, this is terrible. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, here's what BASIC really stands for. <laughs> Boots and socks in Carl. Here's Carl. You can tell he's obviously <laughs> swallowed many boots and socks. He's got crazy spiral eyes, and he's wearing a hat with a flower on it because he's a moron. <laughs> and he's like, buh. buh. God damn Fine. it, Carl. Big assed slobs in cars. Number three, brick ass slaying intelligent cops. That's, that doesn't even make sense. Looks like it's sketched by a madman. And finally, Barry Allen sells ice cream. It is, in fact, the secret identity of the Flash bringing ice cream to the children. Yeah, nerd. I thought 
the big ass slobs and cars was funny, but I thought the art wasn't so good and I wanted the asses to be funnier. So I decided to go with the better artwork and I did Barry Allen sold ice cream. Booyah! That's the best butt I can draw. I'm re rewarding persistence, dedication, and repeated <laughs> elements. I voted for Boots and Socks and Carl. Buh! I also voted for Boots and Socks and Carl. Double buh! Because I couldn't believe Carl had those inside him. He can't believe it either. Look at his big dumb face. I know, I know. I also voted for Boots and Socks and Carl. Nice! What a dummy, right? Oh. Wow, DFTBA is in this. Let's do it. Don't put Dixon in it. <laughs> okay. DFTBA, which stands for Don't Forget to Be Awesome, and DFTBA Games is the designer of the Rolf game, which we played on this show, and which for which the Kickstarter is still going on. Just drew it randomly. For better or for worse, I'm submitted. And this is for five points. <laughs> Number one, we've got dorks feeling too big around. And there is a human table right there. <laughs> I did that in the last t five seconds. <laughs> Number two, dicks. I asked you not to put dicks. Ah, but read further. <laughs> dicks <laughs> forbidden from touching bay's ass. Don't do it. You'll notice there is nary a dick. Because dicks are forbidden. Drink for the boys, aight? And then we've got daisies flying toward boarded airplanes. I voted for drinks for the boys, aight? Me too. I voted for daisies flying toward boarded airplanes because I like the art. I voted for dorks feeling too big around because I feel you. Another five points for me. Shit, Sloan is cleaning. Hey, Brandon. Hey. <sighs> Today's show is sponsored by the makers of Laughcronyms. You can use the code BBGLAUGH to get 10% off of Laughcronyms on Amazon. This offer is only good until September 15th, so get it quick. Get it That's my birthday! Sorry, you guys can do that again. If you That's my birthday! <laughs> <laughs> boom! 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 10% <laughs> off at Amazon for Laughcronyms. Order now, because it ends on birthday! <laughs> Wilting Wheat Wars with CRR, thinking it stands for Common Root Rot. The definition got soiled. Grow this new one instead. This game is a lot of fun. I'm just gonna say that. Well, I'll never win a point, but I'll have some fun in the meantime. You need some confidence. Perhaps the confidence of a bold shirt is what you need. Oh, is that what I need? Is that why you're doing so well tonight? Because you just <laughs> threw on whatever was in the closet? CRR, Credence Rearwater Revival. <laughs> Condoleezza Rice Riot. Crazy Robot Rampage. Coming round the Roundton. And yes, he is shouting buh as he's doing it. <laughs> For sheer chutzpah, I went with number one, Credence Rearwater Revival. I did that one too because I'm, music makes the world go to round. I also voted for Creedence Rearwater. Cold War kids use USSR to stand for Union of Soviet Socialist Republics. Welcome to the new regime. Now it means... Nailed it. Ugh, I'm doing terrible. Umbrella suck soul from Rambo. This is yo give that back. Yo give that back. That's pretty good. I know you do a good impression of my voice. We have Urkel spent seven rupees. United States shits Russia. Oh, Putin. I get it. And ugly Sasquatch says, really? <laughs> Note the raised eyebrow. <laughs> I voted for Umbrella Suck Soul from Rambo solely for Yo Give That Back. Yo Give That Back. That's an evil looking umbrella too. Yeah, that's the soul sucking kind. I voted for Urkel Spent 7 Rupees because I like the specificity of how many rupees he spent. I uh, voted because I loved it was minimalist but effective for Ugly Sasquatch Says Really. <laughs> I voted for Umbrella Sucking from Soul from Rambo. Yes! All right, that's four points for you. Makes me feel better about not having a soul. Way to stop that umbrella from sucking out your soul, Rambo. Hey, you could have stopped it, but you're greedy and lazy. You sucked it out of me. Yeah, it did it to me too. Andre was, the Giant? That was Sylvester, yeah. Sylvester Stallone plus Yogi Bear equals Andre the Giant. You also stole my soul. <laughs> I have no soul anymore. I was, all I wanted to do was walk in the rain. I opened the umbrella, now I have no soul. I told you not to pick up the soul-stealing umbrella! I am not a happy fella. <laughs> <laughs> Astronauts always articulate NASA stands for National Aeronautics and Space Administration. Houston, we have a problem. It also means... 
This one, unfortunately, we cannot take because it uses the words that are already in the acronym, National Ass Safety Administration, and it's Putin. Yeah, it's Putin. Yeah, unfortunately, Aaron is disqualified. I can't use any of the same words? No, you can't use any of the words that are already in well, the Well, then... If you wouldn't use ass, oh. it would be fine. Okay, well, no one's going to get to see that now, dummy. <laughs> Nubby ass, stank ass. <laughs> New ass, shaved ass. What? <laughs> wow. Sensing a theme. Finally, Nero avidly slaps Antichrist. I voted for new ass shaved ass. I voted for new ass shaved ass. I voted for nubby ass, stank ass. Well, I would have lost anyway. Lots of shots. We got lots of shots. We got lots of shots. Say we got lots of shots. We're gonna be having a drawing, and giving away a free copy of this game, Laughgrams. All you need to do is leave a comment in the comment section. However, you have to leave the comment in the first 24 hours that the video is out. If you leave a comment after that, you're not eligible to win the game. It's a Fibs card. What's that, Tony? It's giving a theme to our acronyms. The military just leaked their newest secret weapon, and it's P-I-L. What are the point values here? Uh, it's a 3.1, but it's doubled with the Fibs card, so that's gonna make it six big points. The pain-inducing lick. And when it licks you, you feel pain. And so much so that you say, boom! Yeah. <laughs> Prenatally impending lacerator. It kills you, the enemy, before he's even born. The permanent injury lasso. The pubic inflammation. Lance. Oh, Ow, sure. My mm -hmm. balls. I personally chose pubic inflammation lance. I also chose that. I went with a permanent injury lasso because I support America's cowboy corps. I went with that one too because it's kind of funny that a lasso could cause a permanent injury. How do we break a tie? How, uh, well, we go for the one that the person who was controlling the round voted for, which was me. So that means number three is the winner. Oh, so you're voting against oh. yourself. Yeah, I'm voting against myself. Oh. It counts. Shit. And yeah. he gets six points. He got wow. six points out of that. Well Permanent done, Aaron. injury lasso. Look out. Academic alliances assert. PTSA stands for Parent Teacher Student Association. Disband that definition for this new one. Piranhas, tunas, salmons, Apples. It's three fish, one fruit. It's good. <laughs> post-traumatic stress asshole. And it says, I've seen some shit, man. We also have post-traumatic stress anus. And it says, fart. And it traumatizes the guy. Oh, no, not fart. It, says, it also stands for pull the string. Oh, ha, oh, oh. ha. And there <laughs> is a vampire. Pull the string. Ah, ah, ah. And he's saying, blah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> Which has had mixed results here on Laugh uh, It's not buh, it's blah. It's blah. blah. Sorry. Two assholes might kind of cancel each other out. Sure. I voted for number one. The I voted for number one. Most subtle and best one ever. I voted for number four. Ah, ah, ah. Uh oh, I voted for number four. Ah, ah, ah. That means it's a tie. Which means the one Aaron voted for uh, since he was in charge. Damn it. Wins. Brandy. Whee! Good job, Brandy. You're a fine girl. Such a fine girl you would be. But my life, my love, and my lady is the book. Fibs card. My superhero name would be Pebcac. What? Holy <laughs> shit, this is gonna be worth 12 points. <laughs> it is. P-E-B-C-A-K. This is gonna be the game, I think. Yeah. Time's up. Oh. Um, okay, I'm done. P-E-B-C-A-K. I didn't ask to be a superhero. My life was changed one day. I was a Catholic boy and unused to nudity. And I chose to fight crime, juvenile crime, as pulling every boy's cock angrily kid. My name is Matt Sloan. However, my superhero name is Percy Earl Benson, certified ass kisser. No ba? Nope, it's smooch. Smooch. <laughs> Heroes don't kiss ass, they kick ass. My superhero, he speaks for himself. Putrid egg boy cancer avalanche kid. And he causes a cancer avalanche <laughs> on bad people. I think uh, putrid egg boy cancer avalanche kid, kid wins. I still voted for two. No, I voted for two. But who's running the round? He's running the round. <laughs> yeah. And he voted for M Matt Sloan. Yes! Oh. Matt Sloan wins! I win the game! Crime's ass will be kissed like never before. <laughs> Oh. 
it's the end of the video. There's a couple things you can do right now. If you haven't already liked and uh, uh, commented on the video, maybe consider that. Also, watch some more of our videos. It, every, it makes everybody happy, including you. Buh!